Thank you, man. Thank it was, you. It was, was amazing. A, it, it was, was a amazing pleasure. Experience. Pleasure having you here. Yeah. Zeus is yeah. <laughs> Trust, pleasure having you here. Yeah. in my and bag. You know, at, uh, <laughs> if you want to find out more about the place, description down below. You can find this place. You can volunteer here. Zeus, be careful. <laughs> and please subscribe to my channel. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. Okay. Okay. It's ha coffee time now. I think. It's huh? coffee time. Yeah. Sounds like a good time. <laughs> Let's go coffee. have a coffee. Yes. yes that's my thing. <laughs> Well, I'm going to take the risk. I'm going inside the cage. We have one female and two male. The female is a little bit excited, too excited. Let's see. I'm going to stay here near the gate if something happened. <laughs> Go. Ah. Check it out. Okay, let's see if she's. <laughs> oh, God. Who's calm down? Okay. See <laughs> My name is Francia Skiapus. Well, I've been dealing with lions for a couple of years now. Um, the thing is why I'm doing this is because of the love for the big cats. Um, I love to run a program where I can invite other, other people into my, my, uh, onto the lodge and they can come and work with these big cats as volunteers. Yes. But with the power of this and yeah, the yeah, it's the so cats. powerful. You never realize that when he, when, only when you inside and you actually touch him and you see the size of the head and the, the eyes. claws, the eyes, it's unbelievable. It's amazing. Mm -hmm. He's friendly. Oh, he's just lazy because he just ate it. Yeah. Huh? Oh, you eat. You eat like two, three kilos of meat. Huh? <laughs> oh. Oh. That was a close one. Oh. That was a close one. See that? Wild yeah. animals, in one yeah. second, one second. Last year, September month, my wife parked the car at the back there, as you can see, but a little bit too close to the edge. And uh, she actually opened the door and she tripped. And she jumped over the electric fence and into the ditch. But she broke both her ankles. Amazingly, the, uh, the, the female lion actually was at the bottom as well. She actually just went and smelled her at, on, onto her and she noticed that she was she was injured and uh, then my, my father-in-law he actually called me and the lion was at the bottom with my wife I had a big fright but we actually we were five people that came into the into the enclosure and uh, we got her out very safely and now she's on the way to recovery Okay, I see Zina, the female is yeah, she doesn't little... like me so much. She's, <laughs> she's excited or she's no, actually she... another male inside the cage. <laughs> yeah. There's already two male lions in the cage, and if you take another four lions, li uh, four, four males is... in the cage, and Zeus is yeah. gonna check me, eh? <laughs> yeah, he's just checking the camera. He doesn't it's, it's like the me? technology. The camera. Yeah, he I, I doesn't see like all the, the time technology. Lions try to take my camera away from me. You know? like, <laughs> Fine, you jump me, take the camera. You know, like. It's the technology they don't like. They like only nature. I think it's the strap. I think that it's the it, strap as I well. The red. I know the leopards. Yeah, every yeah. Time they I will go for that. Go inside. Zusa. They try to get the strap. One of them almost got it. I have to fight with him to Look, get my camera back. Go for the strap. Yes, I see that. This is Zeus. Come on. Oh, yeah, got it. Go ahead. Come on. He licked it. <laughs> he licked the stick. <laughs> Zeus is about a year and a half old uh, a Kalari uh, Thero Blood Lion. He's starting to get his mane now, but um, he's still a very young lion. He's didn't, uh, uh, his baby teeth is not out yet, so he still has his baby teeth. 
Um, he weighs approximately about 80 to 90 kilos. Uh, yeah, but he's a big cat and uh, they eat about a, a, a kilo and a half of meat every day. So, and uh, they do get their supplements over the meat as well, which, which, which will, um, it's uh, actually just to, to, uh, to get their, their diet ready. And uh, in about a year or so, I'm going to change from one day a day food to about three days out of each other. And then they're going get, to start getting carcasses and stuff like that. So that uh, it will be exactly like it is in the wild. <laughs> Good boy. <laughs> oh. Yeah, he's a big boy. That's the big one. They grab you with this <laughs> and they pull you down and then they go directly for the throat. And that's a that's a nice picture. Okay. Mooi tanden hoor. Maar ze kunnen het groot geworden. Oh, die love this. Oh. That's nice. Oh, you want to play? Beautiful. <laughs> 